Hello Taproot users, it's the Taproot Tech Guy here again, and today I want to do another feature spotlight. Today I want to highlight our new save and exit buttons that are now available in the recently released Taproot 6.8 software. So first thing we want to do is go ahead and open up our snap chart. And as you can see, we have our incident here. We have flaps failed to deploy at 20 degrees. Well, I'm going to go ahead and add a, an event here. So pilot attempted to set flaps to 20 degrees. I'm going to go ahead and click off. So we can always hit the save button here and it'll automatically save it. But let's say we're done. We've, we've looked at our investigation and we're done. We don't need to add any more um, conditions or events to our chart. So what we used to be able to do is simply go ahead and close this. So by doing this now, you notice we have a protective measure in place that says leave site, changes you made may not be saved. So I'm gonna go ahead and cancel. And I'm gonna go ahead and add a condition here because I know there is a couple conditions. One of them being that preparing to land. So I've got that in there and I'm done. I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do some more investigating, see what other things that the pilot was attempting, if he was going through a procedure and so forth. And since I know I'm done, instead of just hitting save and closing, what I'm gonna go ahead and do is hit our new buttons in the upper left and upper right corners. And if you hover over them, they say save and exit. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And as you can see, it saved it and closed it. If we can go ahead and open our snap chart again, we can confirm that. And there we have, we have preparing to land, which is the last object we added to our snap chart. So there you go. I would highly recommend using the save and exit buttons that are now available in all browsers, not just Chrome. I'm actually using the new Microsoft Edge browser right here but these buttons are available in any of the browsers you use. And remember, just because it's technical doesn't mean it has to be complicated. Thank you and you have a great day.